Absolute Precision Engineering have recently invested in this machine. And at this price point, it's the fastest machine on the market. No wonder they're happy. Peter, you've had your Fanuc Robo Drill only just a few months now. What was the reason behind you purchasing this? Well, uh, Lindsay, we, we actually saw the Robo Drill on your website and it really sparked my interest in the high spindle speeds that it does and the fact we wanted to improve our productivity on the machine. So that's the reason we started looking into uh, Fanuc Robo Drill. And so, was there any reasons why you went for this particular model? Well, it's got a very large table compared to some of the other machines that we've got, so it gives us plenty of flexibility on the size of components that we can run, high spindle speeds, and the fact we could integrate a five axis unit with it as well. Okay, so did you have any concerns about it being more of a lightweight machine? And have you, has it proved you wrong? Yeah, well, exactly. I mean, there is that concern about BT30 being a little bit lighter duty. We have some other BT30 machines. We've had good results with them, and this has got a big plus spindle on, which gives it even more rigidity. So we've really been able to work the machine quite hard. Have you had any success stories from that as well then? Yeah, we've, uh, well, we've been machining all sorts of materials, plastics and aluminiums, which are fairly light duty. Got some productivity savings of 30% uh, or more. And we've been machining stainless steels and uh, alloy steels on it as well. So would you say it's more than a drill tap machine and why? Well, certainly, yeah. I mean, <laughs> the fact that you can machine pretty much everything we can on our BT40 machines on here uh, without any reduction in, in, in productivity or output. In fact, if anything, it's going faster than those machines. And so what is it that you're cutting on here? I know you've just mentioned a few materials, but have you got any specific examples that you can show us? Yeah, well, the bulk of our machining is really in, in aluminiums. So we've got a couple of examples of, of aluminium work that we've done, but we've recently done some steel machining on here making vice jaws up. So you're impressed with what it can do and the power behind the machine, but what about time saving? Well, on the aluminium jobs, we've hit about 30% time saving. I mean, I've gone out to some of my customers offering them an improvement on price, and we've managed to achieve that on every occasion. So I've been very happy with it. So it sounds like you're moving material very quickly. How is the machine about clearing out the chips then? It's been very good. We've not had any complaints at all. We haven't gone through all the bells and whistles, so there's no swarf management system on here, but it's uh, the flood coolant round the tray has cleared out all the swarf perfectly adequately and we're very happy. And you've got 21 tools on here. Is this more or less than the other machines in your machine shop? And is there any negatives to it? Well, we have some machines with more tools and we have many machines with the same number of tools. And what we have managed to find on here is that through spindle coolant means that you don't have to have double tools up on the machine. There's also new tooling out there that allows you to accommodate two or three tools in one. So we've been very happy with it. So just to finalise, are there any features on this machine that you've been really impressed with? Yeah, well, I'm very, very impressed with the high-speed spindle. 24,000 RPM really gives us a major advantage over some of the other machines we have here. We've got conversational programming, which is very easy for the guys to pick up, so some of the guys who are perhaps just learning the system can pick it up quickly. And also, we've got the spindle probe on there. That's a massive advantage for setting your jobs up, making sure they're in the right position when you start your program and you're always going to be cleaning up. Well, that's going to save you time. Let's go back to the high-speed spindle there, and you said it's got advantages over other machines. What advantages are you finding? Well, essentially, it's the cycle times. So 24,000 RPM compared to a 12,000 spindle, you're getting the same feed per tooth, you're just doubling how fast you can move around the machine, so that shortens your cycle time immediately. So overall, what would you say about this machine, and would you recommend it to others? Well, it's a lovely machine, small footprint, very robust, very rigid that we've found so far cuts all materials and it's been nailing every job we've put on it so far.